five, four, three, two, and one. Yo, 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 yo. guys. Welcome back to the Chimin and Don podcast, podcast where we talk about everything and anything. anything. All right? All right? All right? All right? Pew, 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 pew. Hold up. Before we start anything. Happy birthday to me. Happy birthday to me. I'm about to turn 30. Happy birthday to me. Your boy is 30 years old. You're old, dude. I am, man. I am. You're old, bro. I've. I'm not even 30 yet. I feel old, man. I never really feel old. I know, dude. Uh, I'm only 23, and I feel old. I feel old. I feel... You know what I'm saying? I, I don't feel old. I feel more mature, but yeah. I think deep down I'm still a kid. <laughs> <laughs> you sure do act like one? Yeah. <laughs> I am one. So, yeah, remember when we were young, and then we like see like those 30 year olders? We're like, oh my God, you're we're old. like, damn, man. Those people, those, those people are old, yeah. man. And I now remember, it's us. I remember, like, my teacher were, like, 30. I was like, oh, my God, you're so old. Yeah. But remember our 30-year-old hot teachers? <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Miss Moha. <laughs> you know hey, who you are. I'll make sure to tag her on Facebook. Tag her. Okay? <laughs> I dropped the video. Dude. Now, you know, tag her name. I think she's still hot. Last time I saw her at Winco. Yeah? Is she, is she still hot? Yeah. But I froze up like a bitch, though. <laughs> Still freezing up. I, like, I should have go say. I, I was like, I should say her. I should say her. I should say her. I should she say probably her. got some uh, injections done. I don't know. Botox, lip injections. I was like, I should say her. I should say her. I should say her. That no, keep going, keep going. You <laughs> fucking creep, keep going. You fucking creep. <laughs> did you Did you see? No, she didn't see me. She probably don't remember you. Yeah, I saw her. Having I was like, like, oh my god. Yeah, I'm hundred plus sure. kids. Hell yeah. Hundreds and hundreds of kids. Yeah, it's been like what? Fifteen years. Yeah. That that I uh, I was in her class. It's been a long time. Yeah, she might not remember me, but I I I'm still remembering her. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm sure I'm I'm pretty sure she remembers a lot of kids though. Oh yeah, you I'm, know, I, like kids that stand out. She'll be like, oh shit. Well, last she's time grown, <laughs> she's grown. Last now. time oh, when my sister now. was in her class, my sister asked her about me, and yeah? she still remember about me. Yeah, because <laughs> I was a trouble kid. I was a yeah. troublemaker. Yeah, that was like three I, years are like what three four years apart. Me and my sister? Yeah. Uh, no, I was like six years six apart. Six years apart? Six, seven years apart, yeah. you still remember you? Yeah. Remember you? And then, yeah, she asked about her. Uh, she asked uh, her yeah. about me. <laughs> you should have walked up to her at Winko and be like, have you heard? Uh, do you know me? <laughs> yeah, you know me? <laughs> <laughs> She's like, I don't think I know you. <laughs> I think you heard of me. <laughs> <laughs> For sure you heard of me. <laughs> yeah, uh, she said she still remember me and shit. Yeah? She told my sister I was like a trouble. I wasn't a trouble kid, but I was like. I don't think I was a trouble kid. I just don't listen. That's a tr- that. That's yeah, a trouble yeah, you kid. say a trouble kid. That's considered a trouble trouble kid. Yeah. Well, I, I mean, like, I didn't fight or anything in the class. We, I just joke all the time and just don't pay attention. Yeah, and, you don't have to fight to be a trouble kid. <laughs> that's you true, could, that's you true. could do what you're you you say. I, I was just a Joking knucklehead, around, messing I'll, around. Yeah, I was just a knucklehead in the class. <laughs> so uh, did she ever send you to detention or anything? No, she put me in the front of the class. Oh, she did. Yes. <laughs> I'm, I'm like the first one right in front of her. That's why I, 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 no, I, <laughs> I, I was in front of her all the time because because uh, back then I used to I used to be in the back and yeah. it, it was me, uh, the boy Tagger, the boy uh, fucking uh, I forgot his name, Cow. Damn, all y'all got names already back yeah. then. Slang oh, names. Back then, we Tagger. Were, yeah, back then we were fucking gangbangers. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> gangbangers, fool. Yeah, and then uh. Us three will be in the bag and we'll just fucking don't listen. We'll just talk, especially me. I'll just talk and just clown and laugh. Yeah. And yeah, she hated me. She hated your guts. But dude, at that time, I think she was like in her 30. Was she? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, well, probably, well, like probably like high 20s to yeah. 30s. Yeah. Now she's like probably like 40 something. 40 or 50. Who yeah, knows? like close to 50. You're already 30, dude. Imagine. You were what, yeah. like 15, 16? No, probably, she's like probably 40 something. You're like 14, 15 back then? Yeah. Yeah. If she's 30, she probably be, yeah, she probably be like 40. Yeah, like 45. 48. 45. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I still hit that shit, dude. <laughs> I mean, it's not too bad. Once it hits her 50, then that's that's when, you know, that's when they're. The, they're you can start you seeing start it. You start seeing it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Start getting wrinkles. Yep. Yeah. Especially they're white. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> what are you trying to say? Uh, white white people look say about older. White people, huh? White people look older. Like what are you trying to say about all people? 
that Asian don't Asian no raisin. Like we don't really age until we're like our fifties, and then boom, we look like we're like eighties. You know why? But why people like it seem like they age so much? Because I think they, because you know, they have a lot of facial hair. And so that, it makes them it makes them look older. That's it, and because of the skin, uh, the 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 their skin, um, how they call it, um, it's because they're so pale. Yeah. Uh, they're pale, so they they look a little bit older. Uh, it could be just like us, like you know how we have dark uh, dark compl- complexion. You know, um, like if you look at like uh, black people, they they don't freaking don't have wrinkles. But wouldn't you see your wrinkles more though? Because you know you're you have a you're a darker color. No. Compared to like a white person, you know their their no, skin's be- more whiter. No, because when you're you know when you're darker, you you uh you don't have that much shadows. Yeah. You know how like white people when they have like you can see their their their, their black bag eyes. Nah. Yeah, you just gotta really look it close. <laughs> so they say black don't crack, Asian don't raisin. Black don't crack. But Asian people, like I said, we look young for a long time. But as soon as we hit that age where we Look old, we look, look old super old. Yeah, yeah. So true that. And then white people, they just look like they just age and it just <laughs> kept aging. You know what I mean? But for Asian yeah. people, like, it's like okay, we stop aging and then boom, when we hit a certain point, we just fucking look old as shit. Yeah, I mean there's some. It depends how you take care of yourself too. Yeah, you I see like some the, some Asian people where they don't take care of themselves and they look they look like older than their age. You know? Yeah, yeah. And they're starting to, like, well, maybe, they're starting to get bald already and you know, all that. Yeah. Well, maybe you just um. Some like Japanese, like you look at like Japanese girls, how the way they come, they look like they're twelve years old at all times. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, For real, it's like fuck. I wouldn't mind though. Shoot. See, that's what they, I, I, I'm not really attracted to. Uh, like Japanese girls. No, I don't want to say that. Asian girls. No, I, I don't want to say that. Chinese I'm not girls? attracted to girls that look young. Yeah, it depends though. There's some young girls that have a very cute face, and they look they look cool. But some yeah, if they're cute, yeah, but like not like a childish cute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know I'm how some saying. people like uh, uh, what was that? What's that one famous uh uh uh, uh girl? Uh. Pokemon. <clears throat> Pokemon. Yeah, she twitch. Uh, she's a famous twitcher. Yeah, she look like a kid. Yeah, she's like 22, 23. Yeah, but she still look like she still look like she's like fourteen. For real? Hey, brother! Oh, she's so hot. I was like, yeah, is she hot? I mean, she cute, but like, I'm like, she look too young. Like, yeah, to yeah. me, it feel like I'm like being a pedophile. Right? I'm like, ah. yeah, she might be. Yeah, she's like two, 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 and three, but she's like super young. Like that TikTok yeah. chick, you know, the one that I told you that she's like 26, 27. Oh, yeah, she yeah, like, yeah. She's 12 years old. Yeah, she look pretty young. A lot of people was like obsessed with her. I'm like, yeah. yeah. Maybe it's personality that she. No, you know, it's just because she's like. really cute and like a lot of older guys just like that shit. I'm like, you know what? You do. That shit's creepy as hell, bro. Because all the gamers, bro. All the creepy, creepy, creepy <laughs> gamers we got. So, so what you trying to say, huh? The, all those gamer gamers. gamers. That's all I gotta say. <laughs> hey, one of your boys a gamer. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, remember he was a, a hypocrite saying that. <laughs> that why y'all so do it? So if I get addicted, yeah. <laughs> now look at him, bro. He's a gamer now. <laughs> all I do is talk about games. Yeah. Gamer now. I'm like, God damn. <laughs> I'm trying to. Th- I'm, I'm trying to quit playing games. Yeah, that's why I'm not getting a. That's why I prob- I'm probably not gonna get a PS5. Yeah, just takes so much time time out of my life. Oh, don't don't get me wrong. I'm gonna give me a PS5. Right? Don't get me wrong. <laughs> I'm, I'm still gonna give me a PS5. But we'll see. I might get one. But I'm not gonna try to be like addicted. You know. Where, yeah. Where I'm trying to play it when I have work. time. Yeah. You know, I like how I, I used to play like every night. We just we'll stay up to like four or five in the morning. Yeah. Like now I, I I'm cutting it down. I, I'll play on on a Thursday night. Yeah. That's the only time I'll play. Yeah. Yeah. That's the only time I play with the boys, but. Yeah, but think about playing game like the whole night, and then you don't wake up till like twelve or one in the morning. It and fuck that's you like up. Half of your day already, you know. Yup, that messes you up. It does. Yeah, so that's why I'm like, man, I don't, I don't think I'm gonna get a PS Five, man. Especially <laughs> last time we played all the way till what four in the morning. Oh, you did. <laughs> you look tired. You probably were playing last night. <laughs> nah, I just had to work a little early today. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was over here. I was doing the video and all that. So oh, you over here? Yeah. Oh, sure. As soon as I got home, boom, I came over here to do the edits and then all that and then download it, all, all that bullshit, and then went home today. I went yeah. home and then got some rest. Damn. Surprised I, y'all didn't play poker last night. Yeah. No, I, I told them. I was like, y'all can go ahead, but I was like, I can't do it. I was like, I got to wake up early. <laughs> I was like, I have a long day at work. I was like, y'all go ahead, play it. That should make you lazy, bro, staying up all night. It does. Like, 
The next day you wake up, you don't want to do nothing. Yo, well, especially, <laughs> especially, um, because, especially uh, like a couple months ago when I haven't gone back to the gym and all I do is just work and play games, <laughs> play games and <laughs> eat and all that. So like yeah. my my, I had no and we kind of stopped fishing because the season, the weather. The weather. So um, I like I have so much energy like cooped up that. At the end of the night, I'm like, I'm not even tired. Yeah, you couldn't sleep you know? or anything? And then I'll be up all night, and then I'll be super tired in the morning. While I'm at work, I'm like, oh, my God. <laughs> I'm, like, dragging. That messes with your, that messes with your schedule, too, though. Your sleep schedule, dude. you know? I think that's why I'm breaking out and shit. Yeah. Your boy's breaking out, y'all. Damn, y'all breaking out. Yeah, like dude. Four, I woke up with this one. Yeah, like four pink pimples. I woke up with this one and this one. <laughs> Yesterday, I had this one. You know what you should do? Maybe you should... Start washing your face more. <laughs> I wash my face <laughs> fucking twice a week. Uh, twice a week. <laughs> twice a week. Twice a day. Do you? Yeah. You probably gotta just gotta wash it more. I don't know, dude. Cause I notice when I uh, when I wash my face more, I don't break out much. Well, it's because I, I ran out of my uh, my my product. Yeah. So I've been I've been washing with my uh, with my daily uh, my daily wash uh, face wash. Yeah. So I use some soap, bar soap, bro. Is it right here? <laughs> right here is where I wear my mask all the time. My oh mask, yeah, yeah. My mask cup, my cup, cupped up right here. So yeah, I just fucking break out right here now. Damn, son. You wear uh, you wear like for like eight hours too, don't you? At work, eight or nine. Only when I take a break, whatever, I take it off. Yeah. Hey, you shouldn't be doing that. You can't be doing that. And then like when I, I'm thinking tired, <laughs> I just pull it down. So like right here is. Where oh, do you? I, yeah. So, like right here, like down my fucking un- under lip. Is where it's all fucked up and shit. <laughs> just like people at the gym. Yeah. When they can't breathe, they pull it down to like. They pull it oh, down it's to just like the other day we were at the gym. Yeah. I just pull it down. I'm like, fuck <laughs> this, dude. You can do it. Nobody checks. I'm like, shit, my, I'm fucking fatigued, fatigued as hell. <laughs> I'm like, man, I need my fucking ear, bitch. <laughs> it's not too bad. Yeah. It's only when you do cardio. Bro. That's when it freaking kills you and. You know, like I wanted to pull it down so much, so bad, but that girl was just like next to me, so I didn't want to feel like I, I don't want to be like disrespectful or anything like that. So I was just like, nah, I'll just keep it all. Freak it, just do it. I was doing cardio. I was like, fuck. <laughs> I was like, why 15 minutes fucking takes so long? <laughs> was it 15 minutes? Yeah. It didn't seem like it. Yeah, it was a little 15 minute. Yeah. Just a warm up. But yeah, your boy is doing something different, you know what I mean? Your boy is doing a doing? different diet, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, your boy doing a keto diet? Nah, I didn't want to do a keto because keto is too harsh for me. Yeah, keto is hard, dude. I, I need my fucking rice, dude. Like You don't do you can do keto, but you're you're really torturing yourself. I mean, you, I, I, I understand why some people could do uh, keto because they never really like have that much carb in their life. Yeah. So, so they're like, so they okay, if I it. just cut off like pasta and all that, I'll be fine. Yeah. For us, we grew up eating rice. Yeah, so it makes it harder. So it's so hard for us. And we're Asian, you know what I mean? So like yeah. we had rice in our DNA. So <laughs> <laughs> that should go down generation of eating of rice eater eating, you know what I mean? So yeah. for me it, I, I can't cut out rice and for me if I don't have any carb, I have no pump. Yeah. And then I I'll start getting angry and then my energy is low. Then I might have to fucking snap somebody's fucking neck. And then you know, <laughs> your boy is thirty now, so you know. I heard the um like the the pump comes from like the salt and stuff, like it, the sodium. Like it doesn't come from the the carbs. No, nah. that's what I heard. But I don't know if it's true or not. Well, I don't know because I never really uh when I was cutting last time where I did the uh, I guess you could say a carnivore diet because I didn't have no rice. <laughs> For real? Yeah, I, all I eat was just uh meat. Damn. Uh, Good day. My my food wasn't that salty, so yeah. I don't know if I I would get my pump from my, from the salt. Were you getting the, the carbs? pumps though? No, I didn't. Oh, you didn't? I remember, especially like in the because I only only cut out rice for the the, the last two week uh before Vegas. So oh. the first week was fine. Like the first week, I'm like, okay, cool. Like I can I can handle it. Like my I noticed my energy was getting low. Mm-hmm. I, I noticed my energy was getting low, but I I would still have my pump if I take my pre workout. Mm. And then the the last week, the second week is when nothing. <laughs> I remember I was doing bag. I remember I, I was, <laughs> you felt nothing. Yeah, <laughs> like you just felt flat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like super flat, and I was trying to get that pump. And I'm like, dude, like I could feel my muscle contracting, but there was no pump, and I was just getting angry. I was like, fuck. Damn. I was like, you know, a couple more days of this, then I'm going Vegas, and then you know, back to the fucking same diet, and then. <laughs> 
I think I did it too much where I'm like, dude, like now I'm on vacation. I want to fucking go all out, and then yeah. we went all out. Like we were eating crazy shit. Yeah. And after we came back, it's like, yeah, it's whatever now. Yeah, it's whatever you know? now. Yeah. yeah it's because it, I, I, I didn't see a goal after yeah. that no more. I didn't set a goal after you Vegas. Goal, bro. Yeah. To get you going. Got to. Yeah, so the Vegas trip was the goal to to lose weight and yeah. all that. I, that's how I was at my lowest. And uh, after the Vegas, I just fucking like, eh, whatever. You gave up. Yeah, I was like, I still go to <laughs> like, I, I, I'm, I was still going to the gym, but I was yeah. eating like shit. Yeah. So like, it didn't help out at all. You weren't on your diet no more. Yeah, so I was just like bulking up and shit. I was like, dude, your sister wants to lose weight, man. Who? Your sisters. Yeah, Both she of your sisters. Yeah, she don't. Oh, my youngest. Yeah, she don't. <laughs> she don't fucking. She. Man. They were telling me like. Like you're gonna be my couch. Yeah. <laughs> you're gonna you're gonna oh my or your 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 uh, sister um um uh, your older sister. Uh huh. He's like I want some muscle. <laughs> oh yeah, her she she had this plant. Yeah, like, her yeah, she, she had has more discipline. Yeah. yeah. But my youngest sister nah. <laughs> she cooked the other day. Fucking she still have her food left in, in oh, the fridge. She? I'm like dude. Like your diet food? When you don't be fucking eating. Oh, your chicken breast? Yeah. <laughs> She told me that like, she was eating a chicken breast like how you were eating it last time, yeah. like how she grills it and all that. I'm like, Dad, you can't do that. Yeah, you, you, that that thing's not gonna be able to go down your throat. Yeah, I especially. I mean, you could me. you could only do it for a certain amount certain of time hour. only. Yeah, yeah, for like a week, and then you get tired of it, dude. Well, I did it for I did it for four months. Yeah, so it's cool, but it, once <sighs> once you get tired of it and you don't see your and you pass your goals. Yeah. You, you're gonna bounce back to the yeah. place where you at, and you're like, you know, I'm gonna fucking eat and fucking dirty shit all over again. Yeah, especially eating like eating like that. It's, yeah, it's like torturing. Yeah, so now, uh, <laughs> because now I'm like, okay, I still want to eat good stuff. <laughs> That's why I, I, now I'm doing a, a fast. Or, uh, oh, fasting! Fasting where yeah. I, I do 16 hour of fasting, and I only get myself eight hours of eating. Yeah, so. So my fasting start at 8 p.m. all the way till 12 in the afternoon, and then I can eat again. Yeah, that's what I say. I was dude when I came in, I was so hungry. I was like, dude, even though I ate at 12, even though I ate at 12, like that shit just burned through my body. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like crazy, dude. I I always do that though for me. Uh huh. Because I usually don't eat till like, well, I eat kind of late, but then like like 12, and I don't eat till like like 11:30 or 12. Oh, okay. Because that's, okay. that's when I go to the gym. So. I, I would like try to get in a meal before I go to the go gym. Go to the gym, yeah. Oh, so, I've been fasting for a long time. See, like my problem is not about eating in the morning. I never eat in the morning. Yeah. The problem with me is eating at night. Oh, at night. It's like I can't sleep. I'm playing video games. I'm like, fuck. I'm hungry now, so I'm gonna eat. Yeah. It's already like twelve. Yeah. I was like, dad, I can't go to bed because you know <laughs> I ate at twelve. So now I'm playing video games till like three. That I'm like, oh fuck, dude, that shit just fucked up my whole my whole sleep system and my my whole body. So I'm like, all right, by eight o'clock at eight. No more eating Like Cut from 8 o'clock And then you'll eat At 12 yeah. noon again I think you just gotta Set a schedule dude For your sleep Yeah Cause I noticed like You know like When we were like We used to be here late And then I'll like You know We'll stay here till like What like 12 1 Yeah And I'll go I'll go I'll go home And then I can't sleep Till like 3 And then that kinda Messes up my schedule when, when back then I used to like I used to like Try to sleep around Like 12 1 Yeah And I'll, I'll You know and then, like, once it hits, like, 11.30 to, like, 12, and that's when I started getting sleepy already. Yeah, yeah. And then I go to sleep. And then now, when we were staying late, it, it fucked you up my schedule. And then it's like... You didn't get tired until, yeah, like, one, two. like, two or three. Yeah. And I'm like, fuck, I can't, I can't sleep yet, yeah, you know? Yeah, So it's like, you just got to get into a routine where you, you got to cut it short. Yeah. Cut it where you got to be like, hey, I'm going right. to sleep this time. Yeah. I'm going to go to bed at 12, even though I can't sleep till 1 or something. Like, set the mood and then, you know, get tired and then go to sleep. That's you know? I'm trying to force myself. By by midnight, I had to go to bed. Like midnight is is, is like <laughs> yeah. knocking out already. Yeah, you got to man. Yeah, so I, I was like, it, it's fucking my body up, dude. Like especially now we're getting older. Like <laughs> I know for sure it's gonna be a little bit harder to gain muscle and all that. So I'm like, I can't set myself for failure. Yeah, you know dude. what I mean? Like I can't set myself for, for failure, especially if I I keep doing that. And, like keep staying up late. Especially I have a job, a nine to five job too. So. Sometimes I'm doing overtime and all that. I'm fucking up my schedule, so I'm like, all right, cool. Like I had to be really disciplined about my shit, and because that was like one of my my New Year resolution, you know, and I already already surpassed one of my New Year resolution already, so yeah. I'm super happy for that. What was your New Year's resolution? Oh, up you know my uh uh getting my uh credit score up. Oh okay, yeah. yeah. I I never thought it was gonna be that quick. I I never thought I could like. 
<clears throat> get it up that quick. Yeah, I thought it was gonna be by the end of this year was where I'm gonna see that number, mm-hmm. and your boy just went over that number. So I was like, <laughs> "Fuck, dude!" So I was really happy, like that, and that even like motivate me even more because I'm like, "You, you, you did a plan. You stick with it, and then you see your result." Like, yeah. Because I planned that what well, last year already, where I was like. Okay, I'm gonna work on my I'm gonna work on my credit. I'm working my credit. And this year I was like, all right, I wanna see that number. Yeah. And like I said, I thought it was gonna be by the end of this year where I was see, where I was gonna see that number, but actually I, I surpassed that number already. Yeah. And it just the beginning of this year. So I mean I'm grateful. I'm yeah. happy that I, I, I did that. So Yeah, it's good when you set a goal and you like accomplish it, you know? Yeah. It makes you it makes you feel good. <laughs> it does. <laughs> and like I said, it's like a snowball effect, you yeah, know what I mean? Yeah, like yeah. You see that you're like, oh shit! I could implement that into if I could, if my, I could do that, I could implement that to you know, to my other goals. Yeah, you know what I mean. And then, and and, and this year, I would say, and the one of the New Year resolutions, I say, I, I want to get a yak and start fishing mm-hmm. next week. I'm about to get my yak ready, <laughs> so you know, I'm like, okay, like yeah, like this this is the year I say that I, I'm gonna stop procrastinating and. Setting Stop goals. like bullshitting, yeah, like, you yeah. know what I mean? Like I'm setting goals, I, I'm gonna hit it. I'm setting goals, I'm gonna hit it. So I mean, it turned I, out I, good. It's turned out pretty good <laughs> in, the, in the beginning, in this in this new year. Yeah, you know what I mean? I, I'm gonna knock on the wood that I hope nothing <laughs> bad happen or anything that gonna. Yeah, I mean for sure something's gonna be a setback. Always do. Always gonna be a setback, but I just kind of had to keep moving forward, keep pushing forward and shit. Yeah. So you set so many goals, but then. Sometimes it just doesn't come into, you know, you just can't get it done in, well, in that year. You know what? <laughs> I already have a setback. What is it? I'll say I was going to start my, uh, <laughs> my YouTube channel, my clothing YouTube channel. Yeah, it's, it's February already, yeah, man. I haven't done it yet. <laughs> it's February already. Uh, I think I'm going to hold that one. You hold off? I don't know. Yeah, I'm going to hold it off because I, I want to lose weight first. I want to yeah. lose weight and then, and then start shooting, start doing vlogs and start doing uh, fashion. Yeah. I know that you were telling me that, like, dude, you should start shooting right now so you can take the people with you on a journey. Yeah, you got to, man. Yeah. That's what people want to watch. But, but that, that's more that's more stress See, to me. You know what I mean? Like, but that, no, no, no. But think like, about like, it. That's going to that gonna have to be like, yo, you got to. Yeah. You got to. But think about it. <laughs> I'm yeah. like, God damn. But think about that's that. That's a lot of stress, homie. But think about it. That's where you stand out from, from others. You know? You, you just does. can't wait till you lose the weight and then do it. Yeah, people's not gonna, you know, they're not gonna, they're gonna be like, okay, whatever, you know. Uh-huh. But think about it, like doing it from losing weight, that you're, people seeing your change, you know, with that fashion life. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Shit, and then it's gonna be like, oh shit, like damn, that's motivating, you know. Yeah. Like maybe all the big guys would be like, oh shit, like that guy's fucking motiv- a mo- like a motivation, you yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. And they they start, you know, that's how you that's how you Grow stand out channel. from the yeah. crowd, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's true. <laughs> so it's a good it's good if you start now. So I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I, I don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe by probably like in the middle of this year, maybe when I get my camera, no, they, no, they ain't no, maybe. No, well, I, don't, I don't have money to get my camera yet. They know maybe. Dude, I need you to got save, three cameras here. <laughs> I need to save up for my camera. You got three angles. <laughs> All to yourself. Like I said, these are for the studio. Like I need one for me like shooting, every day. But you're gonna be shooting at the studio in the studio anyways. Yeah, you know that's true. But but like it, it's gonna be like a vlog, a vlogging channel, like. Dude, you can vlog with this camera. This camera shoots perfect. It does. Yeah. It, shoot, it, it shoots really nice, but I kind of want something like that. Like I said, I'm really particular about my look of, of the <laughs> camera. Like like your the the uh, the like the quality of it? Yeah, maybe? the quality of it. Yeah. Like, they, these shoot quality. Like, yeah, it shoots pretty good video. It shoots, no, no. It shoots nice, but I, yeah. I, I like, but if I'm vlogging, I like my shit to be blurry in the background. Yeah. These, I mean, these do it. These, these could, but these are, are, are wide angle with a high aperture. So the yeah. angle, the background is not going to be that blurry if you're really close to it. If, yeah. if anything's behind you that's close to you, it's not going to be blurry. Yeah. But I want to think about it. But think about it too. Wait, it's like it's a not low height. But like think about low, it. <laughs> <laughs> like a low F. But think about it. It's not really about, you know, it's the, not the about quality, that much quality of it yeah. too. It's more about your journey. Yeah. You know? it it is. People it follow is. you for your journey. Story they don't follow you for them. For uh, the the video quality, yeah. I mean it is. You, as long as you have the 1080p, yeah, dude, that's good enough. I know. You know, pe- even people shoot with their freaking camera phone. And, I, I think I just use it for get, excuse. They pop. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I was gonna call you. Out. That's not like an yeah. excuse, bro. Yeah, I think I just use it as an excuse. But like I say, like I do like my my video quality to be better. But 
Hey, I will hey, say that. Hey, I will say that to anybody who who come up to me and try to ask me for advice. I'm like, yeah. yo, you give me excuses. Yeah. But I'm, <laughs> but I know that I'm doing. I'm using that for excuse. So yeah. Like I, I'm not gonna lie about it. Like. Yeah. I am using an excuse because <laughs> your boy is kind of scared. You know what I mean? Like, I'm not going to lie. I'm scared. Yeah. What are you scared of? Just running out of content, like running yeah. out of shit to, to talk about and all that. And, and like, w- for the channel, like, a lot of people are doing it already. The fashion? The channel? fashion, the, 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 the fitness and all that. Like, there's, there's people out there that are better than me, but I, I don't know. I mean, you can always find ideas to do it, you know, like. You know, like, you can find a lot of ideas. You do. You know, like, you could do, like, everyday, everyday wear, you know, like, everyday gym wear, you know, show. That's true. Show perils, show all that, you know. Yeah. You could just be, you could just be about your life, you know, what you wear every day, you well, know, stuff that, like my that. life is boring as hell, <laughs> <laughs> because I have a nine-to-five job, so, like, yeah, you know, I can't, I can't record it when I'm at work, because it's a corporate job. Well, it's not a corporate job, but it's a state job. Yeah. And... I work in the medical field, so I can't record myself like, yo, like, I'm about to go fucking transfer this food, you know what I mean? Or <laughs> about to take this food to the gym and stretch them out. Man, but think about it. You don't vlog every day, too, though, you know? You, That's you only vlog, like, certain days where you want to vlog. Yeah. Where you're actually doing something, you know? Like, maybe you wake up, do a wake-up routine, you know? Maybe go to, to work. You don't vlog that. Come yeah. out of work. You know, go to the gym. That, that was I was all that, to, you know. So it's like, but, but that's the same. It, it all, but, but it's the same routine though. Like <laughs> it's gonna be the same routine. Like every every vlog will be the same thing. Because yeah, I'm gonna wake up, go to the gym. Uh, wake up, go to work, go to the gym, come here. <laughs> and then the next week it's gonna be the same thing. Unless we go like a fishing trip where we're going out of town, then it'll be yeah. a little bit different. But the day to day grind is just gonna be me waking up, go to work, gym here. You know what I mean? Yeah. But think Cooking. about your, yeah, but think about all that. It equals, you know? It it, it it brings a lot to the channel. It does. You can show, you know, what you eat every day. I mean, when you're trying to lose weight, so show what you eat every day. Wake up, you know, blah, blah, blah. Do that. Do this. All that, dude. Yeah, well, I, you, you show what you're eating, you know? It's 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 everything, it, you know? I, I, I think I'm just going to be like... I think it, 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 I think it's going to push me to the point where I have to go do something yeah where you gotta go like like go find something to do find, find something for content yeah i and mean that's how that's how every youtuber is yeah and then you for, know like and for me i'm like dude sometimes i'm like i just want to fucking chill i just want to stay home like, <laughs> detain my rest you day fucking introvert <laughs> i just want to be an introvert if i can stay home i don't want to know but you're an introvert you know that right i think i'm getting more sure, introverted dude. yeah i think i think when you start getting older you, you become more introvert that's yeah how i was like, I, I was more get, extrovert like back then, but then as I grew older, I just be, became more introvert. Like, I just don't really care about what people say to me. Like, I don't, <laughs> like if I don't know, I don't really give a fuck. Yeah, like, I don't. Well, like, sometimes you just want to stay home. You're like, I don't want to stay home. Yeah, man. Like, I don't want to hang out with you. Like, I don't care. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that goes. To that and I'm not saying that that only to like the guys only. I'm talking about that to the girls too. <laughs> Wait, what? What do you mean? Like, it, it like it. Okay, so your boy's single as fuck, right? <laughs> your boy's single as fuck. And if I meet a girl and oh. we just talk and I don't see nothing, I'm like, I'm out, bro. <laughs> like, I'm out, dog. Like, I, like, I don't like. I don't really give a fuck. Yeah. And I think that's the bad thing about about me. That is a bad thing about you. Yeah. <laughs> Cause I'm like, man, I'd rather, I'd rather be at home and fucking go to sleep or like fucking play video games or something <laughs> or, or go edit or whatever. You're becoming like those nerds where they, they rather just stay home, play games and do nothing. I, 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 I hope I'm not. Because <laughs> back in the day, I would hang out till like four in the morning. Like, yeah. Even though I, I know for sure I'm not going to even gonna like get laid. get laid or anything. <laughs> like, I know that, the, especially that one night we were out. Yeah. We're at, uh, we're at uh, Audrey's house and you're yeah, like for Boone's birthday. <laughs> you're like, oh, do I? You want to go home? I gotta. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna go home. I'm like, what the hell? It's only eleven o'clock. <laughs> Fight. I guess you go home. I'm gonna go home too. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, dude. I ain't got. It. I was like, I'm getting kind of tired. I was like, I gotta wake up early tomorrow morning. I was like, I'm bound to do. Maybe you be, you're becoming an extra uh, extra uh, introvert, dude. Like, do you feel like your your energy's getting lower when you're around a lot of people now? No. I still like being around people. Yeah. But I just don't like talking to people that much anymore. 
Yeah, so you're becoming I, I, an introvert then. Well, it depends on, on, on the mood I'm at. Like, like it's, it's like you're having a conversation with somebody, but then it's like you talk for a bit and then you're like, eh, like I don't want to talk no more. You know, like shit like no, that. No, I, I like, You can't match up with the energy. No, I never felt that. Like, yeah. like if I could connect to somebody and then, yo, the conversation's forever. Yeah. Like when I went to uh, Boone's girlfriend's friend's uh, a New Year uh, party, I met this dude and like, we fucking like he he, he don't know fucking like <laughs> he don't know it. <laughs> is the cholo coming out of you? <laughs> the cholo's coming out of me, fool. He doesn't know anybody there. Yeah, yeah. I yeah. don't know anybody there. I only know I only know her, and yeah. thank God Sam there was there. So, uh, but I didn't know Sam. I didn't know that Sam Sam and his wife was there. So I would the, the dude was, he came up to me. He was like, "Hey, yo, what's up, man?" I was like, "Hey, yo, what's good?" And we was talking. He's like, "Yo, I don't know none of these people." I was like, "Yo, shit, me too, bro." <laughs> and then me and just kind of talk, and we and we kind of like connected through like. The things that are hobbies, yeah. so me and him was just like chopping it up, and like it was cool. Like me and him were just talking, and like, I didn't really give a shit about other, other people. Yeah. There was some hot girls there, but I was like, I don't give a fuck. Y'all Maybe some young turning, bitches anyway, so I'm like, man, I don't give Maybe a fuck. You're turning gay? <laughs> <laughs> Hell nah. He's a cool dude. Like he was just a cool dude. You're there not talk to the girls, but talk to the guys now. Well, nah, like not, the girls, not, like not anything. You know, I'm not trying to offend the 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 gay community, but yeah. you know, <laughs> not like it, it, it kind of sound like it. It wasn't like I, I'm trying to like smack gay with him. You know what I mean? I'm like, yo, you cool? All right, cool. Like we just yeah, chop like, it he's up. Vibing with you, so you we like, just vibing. Oh, shit, cool. Yeah, yeah. But I um, feel you. But I I, I should have talked to the other girl. She was like feeling me and shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but, so that means you're you're turning. <laughs> But I left home early. I was like, you know what? After the ball draw, I was like, all right, cool, peace, deuce. Yeah. Because I was like, I don't want to drink. You become an introvert then, fool. See, like, if we're just hanging out, I don't want to drink that much. Like, I'm like, I'll have a beer or whatever in the shop. Cool. Yeah. Unless we're at a club or something, you know. But, like, the club <laughs> is my spot. Like, I want to get lit. I want to, like, fucking fuck around and party. And that's when I know that people are there, usually are there to, like, fuck around. So, like, yeah. that's my shit. Yeah. We should go to a club for my 30th birthday, dude. I mean, the club is open again, you know? Yeah. Right? Yeah, when I hit yeah, up that chase, yeah, when I hit up that chase, she was like, yeah, slide through. Is that shit, like, is it mass required, though? That's the only thing. Uh, I at know. this point, I don't give a fuck. You know, you don't want to get at a hot girl, but then when they take off that mask. At this point, I don't care look, no more. Like, scary. I, I'll wear a mask to go to a club, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, Shop down. I'm yeah. Down, as long as we have a mask. Mask I'm, on. I'm ready to party. I'm ready to get dirty with some bitches, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I bet you hella girls go, dude. Like on the first day opening, yep. first week opening, I bet you hella girls go. I bet you hella girls and guys go and then fucking bitches get pregnant, you know what I'm saying? Because <laughs> it's been too long, that bitch guy got dick. <laughs> bitch ain't got dick down, you know what I mean? I'm sure, I'm pretty sure there are bitches that still get dick down. Oh, for sure. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> Even COVID, when COVID's still going on. I can't wait till COVID's done, dude, so I can hit up that one chick, you know what I'm saying? Oh, one chick. Shout out. Yo, I should shout, shout out. Shout her out. I'm not gonna shout her out. <laughs> shout out. You man. know her. You know who she is. Dude, you can do it right now. She, she work at that one spot. I mean, all, I mean, I don't know what you're talking about, but all the restaurant is opening up. You know right? what I'm talking about, right? Uh huh. Yeah, I know you talking about. Okay, <laughs> she Asian, right? Yeah, <laughs> I know. yeah, yeah. Out of yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I can't wait till this shit's over so I can hit her up. Like, yo, ma, let's go chill. Dude, COVID never gonna be over. So why you keep? Might as well freaking take the chance now and do it. Well, the last I I, t- I text her, she, <laughs> that's I text her. She say that because of COVID, and she live with her parents and all yeah. that, and grandparents. So I was like, cool, like I understood. You know, hey, bitch, aren't you tired of this shit? You know, come out. <laughs> Don't you want to get dick down? <laughs> <laughs> I know you want some dick. It's been it's been a while. I've been wanting some pussy. <laughs> like, yo, I dropped my standard now, man. <laughs> You like, driving it down? Hell yeah! So what you try to say your standard was a beer? Yeah. <laughs> now I'm like fuck. Fuck yeah! Huh? Whoever comes, whoever comes, comes I'm a, f- I'm gonna slay. <laughs> nah, nah. I think your standard's still up there. Nah. <laughs> Remember I showed you that girl on YouTube? You're like, I like you. Would you beat? You're like, <laughs> nah. <laughs> And she's not that bad looking compared to like she's you not. know the low the low lows. <laughs> yeah. She's not. She's not bad at all. She's pretty cute. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about right now. I guess I'm just thirsty. Or I I just confused. I don't know. It look like you need some sleep. <laughs> I just need some pussy though to clear my mind. I don't think so. 
Yeah. You know, like you, you know, you know when like you're super horny and all you do is just jerk off and yeah, it, it, it's just different from getting laid. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. From that passionate love. Yeah, that, it, it's fun. It, that it's touch. It's like touch. That touch. Yeah. You know. Yeah. That touch and see in real, like real life. You yeah, see real, her, real life. You see her fucking eye roll back when you fucking <laughs> eat, eat her out. Just. Yeah. And we, Smelling that fucking vagina. Yeah, and eating asshole. that booty hole. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> just fucking eating that booty hole. And tasting poop Fuck. out of her booty hole. It just tasting that fucking <laughs> pussy juice. Mmm. I miss eating bitches. What about that one day old pussy juice? You still eat it? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> bitch, you got a shower. <laughs> that shit stank. Nah. <laughs> well, especially like after y'all have sex yeah, and yeah, you yeah. cream pie her. Yeah. And then like the next morning, it's like, ooh. Nah, that bitch gotta go wash it. And, and your if dick you cream pie her, she better go wash <laughs> it. <laughs> that dick fucking, that <laughs> dick juice too. Ugh. <laughs> like, I, you can smell that shit. I'm like, mm. yeah. I'm, I'm pretty sure girls don't like that dick juice too. Yeah, that did, I mean, there's some nasty ass bitches out there. They <laughs> would. There's some nasty ass nigga out there. I don't even like smelling I'm my sorry. dick juice. Some nasty <laughs> ass food out myself. there. <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah. You know? <laughs> yeah. It's like, sometimes you get that pre-cum smell. Yeah. And it stays in your dick. <laughs> and you smell it, you're like, God damn. I need a shower. <laughs> like, for me, like, um, like, one thing I hated the most was, like, doing one night stand and, like, wearing condoms. Yeah. And then you busting the condom. And then like you come home and they like you know watch your you dick. get no like you get tired I, I just knocked <laughs> out and the next morning I wake up like oh that dick juice <laughs> that's just I fuck do you do you ever like pre come like during the day and you, you don't wash your dick no and that's just stank and you never had that or like, like like you get so horny yeah like you, or like you watch like uh you'll be like. Yeah, like you're just saying, like you're at, you're at work and you're looking at a girl, you're like getting hard. You're like, oh god damn. No, I, I your do. dick's getting hard. You're like, oh shit. And then like you're like, oh whatever. And then you go home and you're like, your pre cum squirting no, out. No, like, god damn, she stank. No, I just jerk off for a pre cum to come for out. For real? Yeah. No, no matter what, if you like get hard. Really? Sometimes you get hard long enough, your pre cum comes out, like yeah, a little yeah. bit of it. You never I, had that? I mean, I get hard, but my pre don't leak. For real? Maybe you got to get your shit checked out by the nah, doctor. Maybe I just got a big load. <laughs> <laughs> this is like squirty out already. <laughs> your balls Let like, me out. <laughs> your balls all the way down to your knees. <laughs> <laughs> no, I never had that before. Really? I think you had it. You just don't notice it, bro. Or, or maybe I'll be like at a strip club and like my pre cum will be coming out. But oh yeah, like that. But when I get like home, I take shower hard. or something. Yeah, I get pre cum when I go to the strip club. Girl just fucking grab my damn like god damn. Yeah, girl. especially them dirty ones. Damn, I'm just going to a strip club. <laughs> it's open again, man. It's open, but I ain't got money. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you do got money. I do got money, <laughs> but I ain't got money for them bitches. <laughs> No more playing playing this year. So. I can't, man. I can't. No money for them bitches. No yeah. more extra money for them bitches yeah. this year. <laughs> well, I gotta pay my bill. I can't be paying bitches bills. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like we say, paying bitches bills. Yeah, paying their bitches bills. Like damn, dude. Like fuck. Why paying their bills when you can't, almost can't even pay for your yeah, bills? Yeah. <laughs> so I'm like, you know what? I'm I'm gonna hold up on. I'm gonna hold up on the strip club shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, don't get me wrong. It's fun. Like, especially there, because like even the COVID time, like. Um, I'll go to a strip club with one of the buddies and like, it, 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 it's fun because like, yeah, it's been like four or five months that I haven't like seen a girl, seen it, not seen a girl, but like, Touch had a that, girl? yeah, had that, that <laughs> interaction with, with like a chick. Yeah. Oh yeah. You know yeah. I mean? Like even though they just fucking around playing, but you know what I'm saying? Like it feels good. You know what I mean? Hey, yeah, some don't play around. Oh yeah. I know. Some like it. I mean, <laughs> some, some, some give you more, you know what I mean? <laughs> hey, you've never seen, have you ever seen a you heard we heard the stories about uh, strippers, uh, you know, falling in love with with clients. Oh yeah, and they fucking start a family, uh -huh. you know. Uh -huh. So you just never know. But yeah, that's true. I know, yeah. I know a stripper that 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 I, I don't know if he, she fell in love with him, but yeah, she had to kill him. She they 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 hooked up, and I guess she's like, yeah. I, I mean, he got money, you know. You know what I'm <laughs> like, that's what strippers like, bro. Yeah. He got money. They ain't fucking with you. I mean, I mean, if you have money, <laughs> I mean, ain't that ain't that what all bitches want though? <laughs> <laughs> I got with fucking money. Hey, <laughs> money talks. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Talks. That's money talks. Money. Look at this. Okay, so the jo <laughs> one of this joke I always tell girls, right? I I forgot who I got the joke from. I think it was Chris Rock, <clears throat> but he was like, "Yo, if you a woman 
<laughs> if you broke, yeah, yeah, yeah. If you have a pussy and you broke, yeah. you dumb. Yeah. He was like, yo, like if you have a pussy, you can get money. Yeah. He's like, he's like, if if, if you turn the pussy to on the sideway, you open it, it's like a wallet. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> so it's like, yo, if you, you have a pussy, and you broke, you dumb. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, for us, like, <clears throat> guys are fucking dumb. Guys are dumb. I feel like I'm dumb. Yeah. Especially, <laughs> like, girl, yeah, especially when I was younger. Yeah. But uh. for girls, like, <sighs> what? Money made bitches fucking wet. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, yeah, mo- yeah, money. Bitches get wet. Yeah. I mean, th- this certain, oh, I'm sorry. This certain girls that, that don't care about any of that shit. Like, yo, I don't care how much money you got. Those are the, the rare ones. Those are the, especially now, day and age, those but think are about the it. rare ones. But think about it, girls. All, girls want a man that has a little bit of money. You oh, know? for sure. Like, they don't want a broke ass dude. Oh, for you sure. Know? <laughs> and take care of them. So, yeah, yeah. Like, <laughs> it, it comes down to, uh, not genetics, but biology, right? Like, yeah. As a man, you're supposed to take care of stuff. Like, if you don't have money, at least you, you have the drive to have a dream or yeah. chase your dream or have other goals where, like, you're not always at home and she's just taking care of you. Yeah. And in that case, she's just going to feel like she she have, she have had a kid. Uh-huh. You know, like, you're her, you're her kid. <laughs> you're not kid. even her partner no more. You're her yeah. kid. Like, I always joke around, like, yo, I want to be a stay-home dad. Like, yo, that's my <laughs> dream. Yeah. But technically, that's not gonna work because you be stay home now if you're if you're if you're a real estate guy. You yes, know, where you know your money's just coming. But but but, but, but that's what I'm saying. Like, I'm saying like at least you still have goals and money yeah. and money still coming, coming in, in and all that, yeah. right? But if you're like a broke broke fool and you don't you ain't do nothing but fucking just chill at home and she go to work and she come home, yeah. In the beginning, she be like, "Yo, like I love him, so I'm gonna let him do whatever." Yeah. And then y'all get into a real relationship like yep. 14 years after, and then she's yep. like, "Yo, you need what the <laughs> fuck? I'm over something. here working like fucking like two, three jobs, and you're fucking staying home chilling." Yeah, you know what I mean? Like, you need to get the fuck out or do something, right? Yeah. So yeah, uh, when people say that money don't matter about relationship, they say it's all about love. Nah, bitch. Yeah, money play a big role in, in the relationship. Yeah, just like they said, money don't money don't make me happy, but really. Money do make you happy, you know. Fuck yeah. I don't know why the people say that, but pe- money is almost everything, you know. It money open doors, yeah, open doors. It fucking buys you shit. Yeah. Even though you say you buy shit, but you're not happy, but it gets you happy. At it's not that, like because uh, when, when 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 you say uh, when people see you that you have money, they're like, oh, you're materialistic. Yeah. Like you have money and you buy whatever. Maybe you're materialistic. Like no, dude. Like maybe I'm not materialistic. Yeah. Maybe I want money so I can go travel. Yeah. Money make sure money 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 let you do that. Yeah. If you broke, you're like yo, I, I ain't materialistic. <laughs> yeah, because you broke. Yeah. That's why you're not materialistic. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Those people that say that are probably the broke ones. <laughs> yeah, like broke, like you broke. Like yeah. for me, like don't like money me, don't make me happy. Like don't get me wrong. Like wait till you get money. Yeah. Then it's gonna make you yeah. happy. You know. Some of that money's gonna change you. Yeah. Like a lot of people say that money. Cha- I, well, I don't say I don't say money change you. I think money magnify. The real you Yeah 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 You know what I'm saying Like when we Like especially like People that are, are in a relationship And they kind of like Just average And then one hit the lotto Like the husband hit the lotto yeah. and, and he divorced her <laughs> It's not because it, Money changed him It's because He already thought about that Long time ago Like about Yo if I hit a lotto I'll divorce my wife And give me a hot <laughs> one And then yeah. His dream came true And he divorced her And got a new chick yeah. Or the guy Or the same thing Uh Vice versa, the girl do the same thing to the guy. Yeah, I, like I said, I don't think it, it, it money changed somebody. Money just magnify who the, who they really are. Yeah, you know, I think money do change people too. Like for me, like like for me, right? I, I'm not a, a really like a like a, a, a materialistic, materialistic guy. guy. But I think if I was to get money, more money, I think I'll, I'll start like buying shit. You know? Oh hell you know yeah! Saying? So it's, it it does kind of change you, but then it's just. It's just it, it depends on some people, you know. You See, know for me, I, I'm a materialistic as fuck. <laughs> yeah, you are. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not even gonna lie. Yeah. Like, I don't care about the Louis. Oh, don't get me wrong. I want a Louis <laughs> bag. Don't get me wrong. Yeah, right. You got, dude. I want me a Louis bag for sure. You shout. got a Louis bag. You got a Coach bag. You but, got a what? A uh, fucking. But I'm not those type of Louis. But, uh, but Louis I'm not those type of people that will Wallet. flaunt it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like you know what I mean? Like, like, like yeah, the IG, like those IG people, they were like yeah. flaunt the supreme shit. I'm like, yo, throw that shit away. <laughs> that fucking whack ass supreme. Like, I want a badass suit. 
yeah. that nobody know the name of it. They're like, yo, that's a badass suit. Well, they look at it, they're like, yo, that should look everybody. I'm like, yo, play, you don't know how much I spent on this fucking suit. you're going to post it on Instagram. Nah. So you're still flaunting it. Nah. <laughs> like, like, but, but, but I'm flaunting, but nobody knows it. Yeah, yeah. Because, cause, okay, like, so I was watching these two, uh, these two, um, these two uh, men's uh, fashion. Yo, they sharp ass fuck, dude. Like, the yeah. way they dress, <laughs> fuck. And then they're like, yo, he's like, why do you think Supreme and Gucci on the t shirt, they have big ass fucking logo of their name and all that, right? Mm-hmm. He's like, yo, he's like, if you really do your research, he's like, yo, go look behind the tag. Yeah, the tag? The tag of the, the clothes. He's like, yo, that shit made our cotton. He's like, yo, I can oh, get it? that shirt for like fucking like 10 bucks. Yeah, and just put and put a fucking, put a fucking Gucci logo, logo on it. <laughs> <laughs> he was like, he was like the real, like the real rich people. They never flaunt Gucci or Supreme or yeah. any of that shit. They're like, they wearing things that you don't even know what yeah. it, what it is. Like it's not even like a brand, like a big brand, it's brand even, name. It's a brand name, but they don't flaunt them because they yeah. know their value that that or, or whoever buys buys it know what they're worth. Yeah, Supreme and all that. It's just a fucking. It's just a I don't want to say a hoax. Yeah. It's just a a, a a trend. Yeah. Like yo, you got that Gucci back? Hell yeah! <laughs> you see this Gucci fucking T shirt that I bought for like twenty five hundred? Like yo, you stupid. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You dumb. It's kind of it's kind of like Bill Gates to like maybe like Elon Musk. Elon Musk, you know, flaunts his shit more compared to like Bill Gates. He he's more like closed door, nah. like that. Like if you look at Elon Musk, he wearing he he's wearing. Like not nothing flashy. It, it, but that that's Bill Gates though. You know, like Bill. Okay, maybe maybe it's not Elon Musk. Maybe it's somebody else. Like Bill Gates compared to you know, like let me say this. <clears throat> Bill Gates compared to these rappers. They have the chain. They have yeah, the, something like the, that. The, yeah, the, the fucking diamond Rolex. Like you, but they're not, just <laughs> fucked up the Rolex watch. But they're not mother. rich though. But yeah, no, no, they're, they're rich. not rich to the point where they're no, like no, Bill no. Gates rich. No, and no, Elon Musk rich. They rich. Real rich. You know what I'm saying? But they ain't wealthy. Yeah. Like yeah, it could be that. like Bill Gates and 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 Elon Musk and them, they'll yeah. never go broke. Yeah. No matter what they do, they'll never go broke. Yeah. Lil John could go broke. <laughs> you right. know what I'm saying? Yeah. Nelly could go broke. I think Nelly is broke. Bow Wow is broke. <laughs> A lot of them are broke already. Like yo, they rich. <laughs> yeah. But they can get broke. Yeah. If you keep fucking around, you can get broke. <laughs> you keep fucking around, not you know. Yeah. Put that money into something, something that. Especially like those diamond fucking those diamond uh. Fucking like I said, those diamond Rolex. <laughs> yeah. Like yo, you just fucked up the value of the Rolex. Now you can't get no money back from the Rolex. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like you dumb. Yeah. Buying fucking dumbass spinning rims on your fucking <laughs> car. Like come on now. Hey, look at Connor, man. He's rich, but he's making a good move. But, but, he's making his his liquor business. Yeah. I mean, like he's <laughs> he's doing that, but <clears throat> behind closed door, he's doing something. Like he's investing. Like they okay. said a line where he said, like, "My Gucci man or something like that. Yeah, he's like, he's like, <laughs> he's like uh, pull, pull a beer, uh, pull. <laughs> Gucci man. <laughs> like yo, like he's doing all that, but behind closed door, he's he's working. Yeah, he's smart. Like smart, uh, like smart uh, money. like um, what's that rapper name? Um, Chameleon, 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 Chameleon. Chameleon. He's the one that sing Chameleon, that song. Chameleon, um, Chameleon. No, <laughs> he's the one that sing that song. Um, what song? Five, I forgot. But he's like an old school rapper. He's like a little bit. He's like in the ninety, early two thousand rapper. He's a businessman. Yeah. Like, yeah, he's wearing chain all that in his music video. But yo, he's investing in housing and property. Yo, he's one of the richest rappers rapper. that still have money now. Like Fifty Cent, smart investment yeah. and all that. So. It depends on what you do with your money, and like I said, money yeah. don't. Dr. Dre, Dr. Dre, multi billionaire, <laughs> baller. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> baller. Yeah. Smart with that money. Set for life, bro. Like all these like young rapper, like, like I don't want to hate because maybe when if I was young like that, I'll probably do the same thing. Yeah. Because you know when you we get grew, all money, you're like, fuck. especially you grew you grew up like us, like poor middle class. Mm-hmm. Of course, I have money. I'm gonna buy me a fucking. <laughs> I'm gonna buy me a car. Hell yeah, buy me a fucking car. Like, yep. Even now, even like, now, buy me a car. Yeah, like, if I make that much money, I'm like, yo. If I see that much money, I'm like, all right, cool. But like, I'm smarter now. I'm like, okay, I'm gonna use half. Like, yeah. I'll use 25 percent of that of what I make, mm-hmm. and then buy whatever I want, and then save the rest for investment and tax and all that. 
But maybe if I was young back then, I'd be like, Phew. hell yeah, I'm gonna go all out, bitches <laughs> and fucking drugs, anything and for the bitches. Yeah. <laughs> so imagine you that young picking a girl up in your fucking Ferrari, bro. For real, dude. <laughs> like you 18, you driving a Lambo, <laughs> them bitches. The bitches are like with a rose with a lot with of a money. Yeah. Fu- with a presidential fucking rolly. <laughs> Player. Damn. Ain't nobody know about that presidential fucking rolly. <laughs> Dude, imagine you any, imagine you, you become a baller. Yeah. Would you like would you do that for your kid? Would you ball the shit out of your kid? No. Would you give a lot of money to your kid and you know, make you know, give him a Ferrari? No. They could be rolling out in the Ferrari. No, because because <laughs> that's my money. I work for that. Yeah. They did it. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? Like, don't get me wrong. I'm still gonna treat them nice. Like, I'm gonna take them good. Like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give them good stuff, like good clothes and all that. But I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna just give them money whenever they need it or I like, buy them like expensive stuff. Like, no. Yeah. I'm gonna treat you like a regular kid. Yeah. Make you work, work your and ass. And you it. Gonna, yeah. Even though you know that I have money, we have nice stuff. Yeah. But that's daddy's money. Yeah. That's not your money. <laughs> that's daddy's money. Yeah. Now don't get me wrong. I, I, I'm gonna give them handouts. Yeah. Like he a AO pop like Nah I'm, you don't give him handouts Like he's you like No no like he's like AO pop I'm 18 He's like yo like I'm going to this like Fucking like college Whatever He's like yo I, I need something like To, to, to kind of like Be proud of myself Like alright cool Like you know what You've you been You've been a Good kid this year Like all that You know what You're, you're moving now You're going to college You're going to uh, All that You know I, I, I'm gonna hook you up Yeah Probably go buy him like a Like a Honda Accord You know what I mean <laughs> Like a new Honda Accord, right? Like, you teach them, bro. Yeah, like you can't just buy them a new, a nice you can't car. Can't buy them like a BMW, yeah. like a hundred fifty thousand dollar fucking car, and then yeah. they now they now they're gonna start feeling like they're 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 um, the shit. Not that they're the, the shit, shit. But <laughs> not that, but like they 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 feel like uh whatever whatever they ask you you will get to them like they just yeah. feel like they're what's that word I'm looking for? The sh- they think that the shit. No, it's not the shit. They're balling uh, out with their friends in the car, you fucking, you know. 100, doing 100 mile per hour on the freeway. It's not that. It's um, <laughs> entitlement. They're entitled to things. I'm like, no, I never want my kid to be entitled to nothing. Yeah. Like, yo, you work for that shit. Yeah. You want a car? You give me all aces. And you go to an <laughs> a, a, a fucking college. Uh, all, yeah. Uh, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, yo, no, nah, you have to work for your shit. Yeah. And you're paying for your college, bitch. Yeah. <laughs> like, I'm going to help you pay you for your college in, like the first two years. But other than that, like, you pay for your degrees. Yeah. You gotta have to go to work. Like player ain't money ain't gonna come. You when you go to college, you gotta have to go work. Yeah. You can't just start at McDonald's, whatever. Whatever you do, work yeah. somewhere. You can't just you can't just take my money and Yeah. You know. I could I felt like Cause we do know some people that their parents pay for the college. And they ain't and shit. Their, and their dorm room. <laughs> yeah, and, and they ain't shit. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying? And like I say they just feel entitlement. Yeah. When you talk to them, you can't really connect to them because they just feel entitlement. <laughs> and you're like <sighs> I think just some like I, like for me it's just like I'm like fuck, because I never grew up like that we never grew up like that like yeah. whatever we want we have to work for it yeah like a lot of kids they see us they're like oh y'all y'all rich no motherfucker <laughs> y'all, y'all don't you yeah. know how long you know how fucking every day we had to go to the farm till like 10, <laughs> 10 11 and they come home do homework and then go to work, go to school tomorrow like no you never seen that shit yeah we got no fucking weekends off <laughs> we got no fucking weekends off <laughs> probably like. We'll get it once in a while, but it's like we got it when we're a little bit older. Yeah, and we, we can we, we can like, hey, I can't go this week because you know yeah. I got I got a I got a party to attend. You know what I mean? It's like every weekend there, my friends are like, hey man, let's go do this. I'm like, I can't. I can't. <laughs> I'll be at the farm. <laughs> I'll be at the market. <laughs> yeah. So a lot of people never see that shit. Yeah. So for us, like, when I see people that are entitled to things, I'm like, Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. yeah, that should disgust me. <laughs> All right, let's end yeah, this right here. here. It's been a while. It's been a while. We try to cut our, our our podcast a little bit shorter now. You know what I mean? Yeah. Everybody hates that, that long. Make it podcast. a little bit more digestible to to people. Yeah. Everybody hates the long podcast, man. Yeah. You know, so we got to cut it short now. Yeah, we got to cut it short until until we start like until we start like uh, accommodating more uh, more uh, subscriber and we start getting known. And then, you know what I mean? That's when we're gonna do a little bit longer. But now we're gonna keep it at forty five to fifty minutes. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. All right. <laughs> All right, guys, we want to say thank you guys so much. God damn, I think that shit is higher. want to say thank a, you, yeah. I thank you to y'all. And, uh, we want to say peace out, bitches.